everyone has everything going. You guys did an amazing job. I really love the film. I feel like y'all really just brought it with all your characters that gave us so much oomph and color. Um, and it's funny to see how you, you know, Amber, you were actually the assistant. Now, my question is for all three of y'all. When it comes to having an assistant, you got a vet. You know, something that I wish Raven, your character did, but it's okay, because we got it together at the end anyway. Now, my question is for all three of y'all. When it comes to vetting the best assistant for yourself, what is one trait the assistant must have? And let's start with you, Janet. Ooh, you would, wouldn't you? <laughs> <laughs> um, it has to be honesty. Mm -hmm. For me, it has to be honesty. I have had occasions where I've had nannies that were like straight out of hand that rocks a cradle and assistants that will steal from you. You know what I'm saying? I, I was listening to the ladies talk about how together you all are when you are up for roles and things like that. And that was not the way it was for us growing up because I was in the dance world, the theater world, the acting world and the singing world all at the same time. So it's a pleasure to hear the, that, that they are a different generation than we were. Because, <laughs> you know, so honesty, it would have to be for me because that's the most important. You're gonna be around me, my family. You're gonna be around my paperwork. You're gonna be around my business dealings, my account numbers and things like that. So honesty and trust is huge, huge. Okay. Amber, Raven. For me, um, in, oh, in hiring my assistant, um, hi Tanasia, um, for me it was, her not being a complete stranger. Like I needed to know somebody who has worked closely with her before. That was a, a big thing for me. Cause I can't, I cannot blindly trust. Like even, even my nanny, I worked out with her for a couple years at the gym before, you know, I knew, I knew her before I even got pregnant. So it's like, it's like, I, I just need some kind of familiar, somebody knows who you are and uh like Janice said just that honesty piece that uh, that authentic uh piece too like you need to be I, I just need to feel good energy good vibes especially if you're going to be around me and my family and be I, I can't give up the account numbers yet that's just not who I am <laughs> or the credit card number <laughs> send me the invoice <laughs> you pay for it send me the invoice and I'll reimburse that's who yeah. I am um but yes, um, Tanaja's awesome. Shout out to my assistant. She saves my life time and time again. Beautiful. Ash cards work. Okay. <laughs> okay. And Amber, want to wrap it up here? What about you? Yes. Um, I love a, a person that's organized because I'm a walking tornado. So <laughs> <laughs> in every sense of the word, in every sense of the word. <laughs> so... That was so important to me when I got by my assistant, like, I need you to help me just organize my life. Because if you tell me the time that I need to be there and when I need to start getting ready, like I am that person, hold my hand because I have a million and 10 creative things going on in my mm -hmm. brain. Mm -hmm. And so sometimes the practical things kind of like grocery shopping or girl, you need to buy new bras. Like <laughs> you, you okay. need to go buy socks like just little things that I would probably miss um the little details for me awesome thank you all so much make sure that you all tune in to single black we want she comes out next week okay February 5th and happy early birthday Amber thank yeah. you thank you so much uh -huh.